Hi friends, happy to see you all back with ILLC. We are coming with a new program, and after a long time, I'm just coming back with a, a new new set of ideas, and I'm sharing for all our insurance friends. This time, we are coming uh, with a program called Pandemic Heroes in Insurance Industries, who people are done extremely uh, excellent in this particular pandemic. You all know that we have uh, got crossed almost three, four waves already. We have in uh, Alpha, Delta, Omicron, I don't know what more is going to come on right now on our business, the struggle. So let's want to bring this year brightful for all our friends who want to do a COD, TOD is another thing. So really I admire about one particular person. I keep following her for so long. So I'm bringing to this particular program. Could be our first program and uh, Pandemic Heroes. I like to welcome my friend all the way from Lebanon, Laila. Hi, Laila. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. I'm fine, Laila. Thanks for accepting and coming forward, uh, giving an interview for us. And uh, uh, always seeing your photographs and your Facebook, it's always admired for us to do more and more business in our industry. I'm happy you're both following her. So tell me about yourself. How, how admired yourself? Tell me about what, what was your motivation and other things. Hello, uh, thank you. It's a pleasure to meet you and talk to you. Uh, I'm Leila al Masri from Lebanon. Uh, I joined uh, with background uh, business accounting and psychology. Uh, I used to work as uh, in a office uh, as an accountant. Uh, after eight years in a factory, I chose to, uh, as a position of assistant manager, I chose to start a new journey. Uh, my life in 2019 and I set my goals to to protect as many families as I can from all the risks that might happen um, disability critical illness early death retirement especially after corona uh, for me it's not about life insurance it's about love insurance Actually, my, uh, my journey began with a dear case to my heart, a young cancer survivor. He started with me, his coverage, six months before, his, uh, before being diag diagnosed with a cancer. Um, oh, his dream came true. Uh, he took his money uh, to invest and buy his collection card and my determination became stronger. So I need to, uh, to protect more and more and more families. Uh, till now I have around uh, 350 families protected, more than 900 counts and oh. still count. Oh. <laughs> All these families will not uh, face any financial challenges despite everything. So in 2019, I became an aspirant in MDRT in 2020, a COT, 2021, double COT. Wow. <laughs> so 22, I don't know. <laughs> it, it, that, that's what you, you've grown something in the pandemic. So that's make a, a, a more impression motivation to anybody who been to see. Uh, I've been in the stream with more than 15 years. So we are try hard to do a lot of business and a lot of uh, things. But my uh, my impression is I always want to talk people who've done a business, right? So. Oh, what was the secret begin? So you you were so impressing about um, talking about 350 families was saved. So I'm so happy about that. So Laila, I'm not taking much time on you. I'm going forward to questions. What's really want to ask you on that? How long been this particular profession you already told about from 2019 onwards, you are there in the profession and that. So what make motivate to come to this particular industry? Uh, what motivates me actually, uh, this young survivor, survivor uh, young uh, cancer survivor, he, he gives me a big, uh, I have to, uh, to see more families, I have to be with them, I have to let them trust me, trust my product, uh, let them uh, face they, their fear, their desire, what they know, uh, what they need, their retirement. Uh, so uh, I don't stop talking about my, my work. I love what I'm doing. Uh, that's it. It's about, uh, if you want, uh, in simple words, it's about activities, activities, activities. 
especially in a country like Lebanon, full of crisis, uh, especially after Beirut explosion, uh, the bank crisis, uh, the money is stuck in the bank, uh, the corona, every, every day we face a new, uh, new kind of corona. Uh, so every day I face new people uh, in the hospitals. Um, let's say uh, today I'm with them, tomorrow they will pass away or they will pass away. Uh, everything in Lebanon is very challenging. So um, what motivates me is this is my work. I have to be around them in all the situation with them for a happy tomorrow, for, for a happy future. Uh, for me, it's more than enough to work. <laughs> work and work and work. Great. So uh, uh, I think uh, uh, always in our professional like family is our strength. So can you share about your families and uh, how do you work with your client? So you've been a double TOT, right? So what, what special makes you make work with your client? Yeah. Uh, and I have two families. I have two families. The first family, my family, my dad, he's a two, uh, he's the love of my life. My brother, three sisters. Uh, my mom unfortunately passed away uh, six years ago. So uh, I'm taking care of all of them and happy for that. And um, the other side, my family, the, the second family are my clients. Uh, I'm around them all the time. I became very friendly with them. I trust them. We shared everything that they need. If I need anything, I am looking uh, forward, uh, let's say for a car, I contact anyone from my client to, uh, to help me. So uh, I built a trustable, uh, if you need relationship and long relationship with them. So for me, it's the, the second family for me. So two families and one is a professional family is always connect with you and happy for that to know here at that. So how you feel when you become a TOT member? So always the first impression, best impression, like, so what was your feeling? So Proud of my feeling. And uh, uh, what what was your experience bringing to uh, COT to TOT? What, what made you do like that? Uh, since 2019, I chose uh, to know. To uh, I know, I know to. I want to build more and more uh, clients. I know I want to build a big family, a big second family. So uh, once they trust you, they can con connect with you. They can sign with you. They can uh, give you more and more prospecting, more clients. I put my mind into let nothing any client. Uh, go without giving me a, a prospect or a client, another client. So I'm with them everywhere. So uh, that's why uh, I'm taking prospecting every time from my client, from my honest client, if you need. So that's it. <laughs> uh, being a competitor, being a uh, MDRT friend, uh, being that normally, commonly, they'll ask the question on that. What was your secret of success on this pandemic? What was you done something different anybody else not done? So you become into double TOT. Uh, I guess trust. When I build trust with the client and I try, I'm trying all the time to give them what they need. I never, uh, you know something, if you want to lose a trust of someone, uh, you try to, to let to sell him something they don't need it. If you try to sell to sell him something they don't need it, you will lose this trust. So from this, I uh, from this point, uh, I started uh, to be with them, friendly, honest with them, uh, and this team can pandemic help us to know exactly what they need, uh, to know their business, their. Uh, relationship with their money, relationship with their family, relationship with their fear. Uh, actually with the early death, before no one um, have this pain around and on the death is around, at any time we can lose our life. So uh, I guess the pandemic gives them the, the, right, the right choice uh, to be on the safe side, to begin a life insurance, and actually to think twice for their family and uh, tomorrow. So I'm here for their future, better tomorrow. 
ان لي مانيز بتال على الحلوه والمره اند ذا جود واي اند ذا باد واي يعني اند ذا جود تايم وهابي تايم اند ذا باد تايم وين ذا ذير از انفورتيونتلي ذات كريتيكال النس ذس ابيليتي سو ام وذ ذم اراوند اول ذا تايم واو yeah that you are there for them that, that that's something uh, even been uh, i i come out through uh, covid i know how difficult it is for that actually uh well can you share your uh, prospecting ideas which uh, can be uh, anything something new you are applying in your profession yes. uh prospecting idea uh, actually i'm talking all the time about what i'm doing i love what i'm doing i have a passion from what i'm doing so Every time I met anyone new, I tell him about what I'm doing. Uh, some of one, some one of people, they don't care. They don't even listen. But soon or later, they will come back to me and will listen. And I put in my mind, uh, as I told you before, I put in my mind, you know, I want every client to give me more and more prospect. Now, also, we have the online. Uh, I can make too much of prospect, a potential client. or after all it will become a client uh, helping people without income no need that they they have a policies with e- uh, any other company i can help them uh, give them opinion um, actually that's what mdrt uh, global uh, do so exactly i'm uh, i'm taking the the steps you did before uh, and i'm working them with it and i'm uh, happy for that i have plenty of client plenty of prospect hopefully i will continue on the same strategy so as a mbrt member i think you start with the aspirant then you become mbrt and you become cod now tot uh, did mbrt help you to grow in your profession too much they had us too much uh, especially you Uh, I contacted you. I send you. I questioned you. Answer me on the spot or whenever you have time. The videos uh, help me give us ideas. Uh, give us uh, uh, ideas how to handle objections, uh, how to create and uh, how to help people, how to love people, how to help people to know what they need exactly, what they want. So I'm in love with the MDRT. They don't stop helping us all the time. Thank you. <laughs> i i landed from mdrt being a voluntary member and uh, it's something we have to do you could not keep your success yourself you need to transfer to somebody who is desperately needed so that's what right now we are doing this program also somebody watching this can could take admire about laila or shakti whoever it is but some somebody's we light up their uh, family or their life that's our profession for it actually so thanks to mdrt again so thank you can you share uh, some good ideas to the new members to the industries uh, how to become mdrt cot even labminis or any any other country but uh, what what was your uh, ideas you followed when you are you are in the aspirant trust yourself trust your client trust this is the best career as ever you can work with them uh, i don't even like, i i can't tell you the feeling I I had when I I came to this young survivor uh, cancer survivor and I gave him the money he used his money to buy a collection car can you imagine this feeling was amazing for me I was in with him all the time actually even uh, when he chose to to do the the last uh, pet scan I was with him, with him also so now he's amazing he's fine Uh, this is the best career ever you can uh, do we're helping people all the time uh, and it gives us a big pleasure to reach uh, tot and the rt the actually i'm proud of myself what i did and every everyone around if you need this feeling he has to work uh, it's all about activity meeting new people uh, it's about also um, pr a public relation uh, work hard talk about this career uh, love him work with him love the family love is lo- love insurance and not life insurance 
I guess this is uh, my success point. I have passion for my work. I love the word that uh, love insurance, not life insurance. That's amazing. And that. So uh, we're going to the final question right now. So this every every time I'll ask for the woman advisor, I meet him that. So as a woman advisor uh, in this professional, how difficult or what kind of issues you face uh, when you're in a professional? I face too many, uh, much of things, but I don't care. I love what I'm doing. Let them think what they need. I know very well myself. I trust myself. I trust what I'm doing. If I, I'm facing every time and every day, a lot of things, but uh, I never let them push me down at all. It pushed me up. I need more. Not all the people think the same quality, same, same, have the same quality of thinking. So uh, forget about bad people. We, we, we want to love people, other people, enjoying life, the real people that need your, our help. Other people, one day, they will come back to you and will say, sorry, be in, in certain place, I need your help now. Yeah, wonderful, so, wonderful. So uh, uh, final question, what the mission for 2023? Oh, uh, maybe a triple TOTA. <laughs> more clients, more activities, more protection. And uh, share, share the new ideas with us also. So we also want to be a UD members in with you all. Uh, actually, I started in my, in my career uh, uh, looking forward also for new and new opportunity. In 2023, uh, till now, I reached around 100K in this uh, crisis. And looking forward for triple TOTA, or at, or at least same place, double TOTA. Uh, we have a big pandemic and still counting on it uh, to cover maybe today, tomorrow in Lebanon, I don't know. Um, I don't know what the, to tell you more than that, but this passion of uh, my work, but I'm looking forward for better and better, knowing more people, uh, watching more videos, MDRT, uh, maybe um, looking for more prospect uh, in different phases, not in just one phase. Let's see too, what's, uh, God, what God will, uh, will give us. So thank you so much uh, for your present, given a special timing and special ideas and uh, behalf of uh, MDRT, behalf of ILLC, I'm wishing you all the best for 2022 as well as 2023. Uh, not only stop with three TOTs, do more and more and be their motivation for all women around the world and uh, want to fly ahead of that. Thank you so much. Friends, thank you so much. Uh, uh, thank you, Laila connecting with us. We will see you on our next video with one more uh, pandemic hero. Thank you all. Thank you. Thank you.